Yo, welcome back. Before the video starts, if you guys could play my new Infinite Zone Wars map, uh, here's the code. Uh, I really appreciate it if you guys could try it and also uh, use code Hyperlore in the Fortnite item shop. Thank you. First off, I'm going to start off with the NVIDIA control panel. So we're going to go to manage 3D settings. And as you guys can see, I have a uh, certain optimizations done here. And if you guys want to improve your FPS and get the gameplay like I showed you in the beginning of the video, you guys should follow these. So I'm just going to scroll to, through these uh, slowly. You guys can just copy the settings. There's a few things that I have adjusted in order to increase my FPS. There's certain options here that increase your performance. For example, OpenGL, GDI compatibility and power management mode, those increase your performance. So I would set these to the maximum performance possible. Also, for frame rate, I have a set to 360 FPS, but it really doesn't matter since my laptop comes with the 144 Hertz monitor. And uh, yeah, these are also some other things I have uh, adjusted. And um, yeah, now I'm gonna go on and show you some other stuff so basically i have this video on my channel as well that shows how to get stretch resolution in fortnite because obviously if you change the resolution that would improve your fps but i'm using an app called uh, alpha res so i also left the download in the description and i have a full video exactly on how to use it but for the resolution i use i use 1500 by 1050 so this is a setting that a lot of people don't really seem to mention it's called the xbox game bar and if you guys have this on just turn it off it really does not help with the performance at all and there's also like a setting here that has to do with uh, recording so i would just completely have the xbox game bar turned off so what you guys want to do is you want to go to your control panel and put this to full screen you got a system and security you got a power options and what you guys need to have this at is ultimate performance for laptops in general, it's usually unbalanced and if you have any other setting, like if you have a Razer mouse or Razer keyboard, there could be other options, but ultimately perform the best is ultimate performance, obviously, so I would keep that on. And um, so what you guys want to do now is you guys want to search up advanced system settings. Hopefully this is right said. All right, do advanced system settings. Okay, so you get this pop up. And then what you guys want to do is you want to click on performance and you guys want to do adjust for best performance. I like to have this on because I like to see the thumbnails of my videos sometimes. So, so, all right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. That's basically it. If you guys have any more questions, leave them in the comments and I will see you guys in the next video.